A couple of years ago, when my daughter was just a little baby, I traveled to a conference in Indianapolis for my job. Well, while I was there, I met someone who was pretty cool, a nice guy, um, but from the moment we met, we talked just about every single day from that point. And now, the craziest thing that I have done for love ever was moving myself and my daughter from Philadelphia to Northern California. I gave up my family that's there and my friends and my comfort zone to give love a chance. When I was in high school, I had a boyfriend um, pretty much through high school and college, and I always had a crush on his best friend. Now, I never told anyone, not sure anyone ever figured it out, but a huge crush on him. And I figured out pretty quickly that um, my boyfriend lived in one direction away from the high school, but his best friend drove past the other direction, which took him not past my house, but past the track. So I said, okay, he goes, you know, football practice, then he would leave every day and, and drive by that way. And I decided to take up running. See him go by, wave, hi, how are you? He did stop once and he talked to me. And at that point I kind of decided, this is enough, um, it's not worth it. To this day, I still hate running, won't run, um, and definitely would never do it for a man. I was a single mom with two little tiny babies and every weekend I would call my parents in Los Angeles from San Jose and beg for them to come up to visit me. But the craziest thing that I ever heard of anyone doing for love is that one time I called my parents and I asked them, please come this weekend and help me and they said no. And when I asked them why, they said, because we're moving. Less than a mile away from me in San Jose. They didn't know where the grocery store was. They didn't have a single friend. They didn't know anyone or anywhere to go. They just came because they were crazy in love with me and my kids. I think when it comes to things like love or relationships, you can never be too crazy. 